used to look at these people going, they must be mad swimming in the dark. But funnily enough, you just get used to it. I think the ocean is underrated as a human benefit, both physically and you could almost say spiritually. I feel like safe. I feel like it's somewhere where I belong, just swimming in the ocean. As you glide off in a cold winter's morning, it's quite an amazing feeling. I don't know what the chemistry is of salt water and the buoyancy of it, but it makes me feel good. You're with nature, it's alive, the high lasts all day. Are you a board short or a budgie smuggler kind of guy, mate? <laughs> I'm definitely a, a budgie smuggler kind of guy. <laughs> the beauty of this community is there's no judgment at all. You come out of the water, you're wearing a pair of Speedos. It's non-judgmental. All status, all prestige that people might have in their other lives uh, disappears when they come down here. Everybody's basically the same. I love coming down here in the community. Everyone will give you a hug, they'll give you a kiss. Sometimes you don't want that. No one knows what car you've arrived in. No one knows what job you've got. No one knows what house you live in. All kinds of people swim from kids, families, old people, triathletes, everybody. The dogs. The dogs are very much part of the bold and beautiful swim. The ladies sit on the wall, they call themselves the women on the wall. Now I belong to the whales, who are the women of the wall. The men over there, they thought, oh, what can we call ourselves? Oh, I know. Men of the door. Poor things. Then there's the 18, the crack swimmers, they also stick together. And then it's just the usual plebs. We just sit anywhere where people are willing to listen to us and acknowledge us. It doesn't matter how good you are, how fast you are, how young you are, how old you are, how f you are. It's just, it's, everyone's accepted. It's just a lovely way to start the day. A lot of people who've really gone through some struggles seem to end up at this group. People go through some tough times and, yeah, and I guess there's a group of people who are here to support you and help you through that. The swim has been really critical to my life. I, I had a, a difficult period in business that made me very sick and ocean swimming was a wonderful release. A lot of these people, if you scratch the surface, once you get through the, oh, it ain't like grand, and then they start to tell you their story and they're down here swimming because it keeps you sane. I had just broken up from a 30-year marriage and her friend suggested I swim. I found it exhilarating and I found a new community and they saved my life, I think. Bold and Beautiful would have to be the world's largest daily open water swimming group. It gives you a reason to get up. It puts you in such a better frame of mind. It doesn't matter what else is going on in your world, what issues are going on for you. Everything feels that much better if you've just had a swim.